Signs of Doom. So this is the final battle of Season 1 of 5 Ds. The sign has failed to defeat all the dark signs before sunset and the king of the Neverworld arose. You were saying the other signs were transported to the, by the Crimson Dragon to Rex Goodwin's location. Isn't this the temple underneath Goodwin's mansion? The king of the Neverworld heading this way, but what for? I don't know. In, uh, in that case, allow me to explain. You may have succeeded in, in defeating the dark signs, but not in time to close the door to the Neverworld. The king of the Neverworld is coming here for the ritual. What ritual? The ritual that has been carried out at this temple for many millennia. The ritual that will allow me to become the all-powerful and ruler of the world. I will crush you, signers, and send you all to Neverworld. In turn, the king of the Neverworld will do my bidding and my ultimate plan will at last be set in motion. Now then, will you agree to this duel or will you not? Oh, shit, I skipped a bit of dialogue. Sounds fair to me, but you wretched signers as we're the ones who as we getting beaten. We'll see, let's do this. I'm something about let's all all this fight him. Downside at that point is I am in the anime, this is actually a 3v1 duel. Um obviously we can't do that in the video game. What are our options? Right away into the Everyone ready for a first win? Start us with again. Yeah, you sit there. Junk Archer, Junk Warrior, Star Dragon, and Majestic Star Dragon. Okay, first things first, tuning. Because they left cards for you say to use to beat him. Yeah, I did it. <laughs> mill tuning of tuning. <laughs> I mill tuning of bloody tuning. Oh, that brings back memories. <laughs> that card special summon quick draw sync from by sending it as level eight to the graveyard. Special summon quick draw in defense mode, and then use level eight's effect. To as lower the effect as lower the level of quick draw synchron by one, allow me to special summon level here from the graveyard. Now the conditions are met because quick draw synchron can act as any synchron tuna monster at all. So now I synchro together quick draw synchron and level eater to make junk warrior. Level eater's effect lower junk warrior's level by one. Looks like he's in my mind. Now here's the thing. Normally, Shining Angel, when it's destroyed by a battle, he gets to search his deck and that search on the monster on the field. But we have Synchro Blast Wave! We're going to use Synchro Blast Wave to destroy Shining Angel by effect. Therefore, he doesn't get his effect. Next, we shall activate the effect of Level Eater in our graveyard to lower the, uh, lower the level of Junk Warrior by one. Thus, in turn, allowing us to spread someone to Level Eater in attack mode. By attack mode, we're going to easily get over this tricky and we may as well get that little bit of extra damage in. Now, keep in mind, we haven't actually normal summoned yet. <laughs> Are we going to do Debris Dragon? No, we are not. I don't think the other one's not allowed to. People in my backyard are talking nonsense. What we shall do is we are going to set this guy as a bit of beefy defense. In defense mode. Because here's the thing, right? Them there, plus Debris Dragon, we have the potential to start us next turn if he gets over Junk War. Battle phase, Junk Warrior. Oh no, not lovely. Junk Warrior, thank you. Junk Level, you're not going to get over the tricky. 300 points of damage, then we'll do an extra 600, bring it to 900 total. I will end my turn I will now activate my trap card just so you know what it is. It's a continuous trap card. I can send any card I control to the, uh, the, from the field to the graveyard other than this trap card to just end the battle phase. We now activate Synchro Blast Wave again. Targeting the monster, destroying it. And I will set the Breed Dragon. Or a bad move, but still. Battle phase, Junk Warrior, and a level eight will now go in for their attacks. Twenty nine hundred damage. That. 
Goodwin has not brought out either of its synchros yet. Oh, there he is, Junk, uh, junk Synchron. We will now summon Junk Synchron. Not yet. Battle phase. Junk Synchron will attack. And I got 100. Level 8 is going to go over that. Well, again, we'll go for 2900. Main phase 2. Time to synchro summon. Our one and only boy. Stardust Dragon! Turn that. I'm not going to use level eight's effect yet. We've got enough defense in the play. Battle phase, Stardust attack. You say awoken as in a strange location. Where am I? Good one. Is that really you? Not just me. Hey, brother, I'm so happy to see you again. It feels as though it's been an eternity. Indeed. Where are we? We are in between the light and the darkness, you say, as a place of peace, and it's all thanks to you. The bonds we form really are all that matter in life. You say, take care. Now, if you excuse us, my brother and I have some catching up. And that is the end of Season 1 of 5Ds. Um, and we now go into the start of Season 2, French Twist. Six months after the Dark Signs were defeated, the bridge between New Dominus City and Satellite was complete. The divide between City and Satellite was no more. Even more importantly, so was the tension between the people of the two districts. Even though everything's peaceful, it wouldn't be long before a new East rose. After a meteor in the shape of a card struck the ground as near New Dominus City, three strangers appeared before it. Here we go. Excellent, it's arrived in one piece. Yes. And already left quite an impression, I'd say. As what else would you expect? It's my card. Is that so? I guess you'll go first. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Remember, there's a plan that we must follow. Of course I remember. I came up with it, and it's perfect. Hey, who are, the f who are you three? What are you doing here? I order you to vacate this premises at once. And I order you to watch your tongue, Worm. Who do you think you're talking to? Now, now, is this really how you want to start off with your new directors? New directors? Yes, the three of us will be sharing the job as your new bosses. Oh my word, I'm sorry, no one told me. I beg your forgiveness. Meanwhile, as Grudge has paid as you say Jack and Crow a visit. Don't tell me you guys are still working the new dual engine prototype. We sure are, if we can get the thing to work right, as it will take our game to the next level. And that's what it's going to take to win the Gra as Grand Prix. As the, as the toughest, roughest dueling contest to ever hit New Domino City. Since it's a free duelist team, creating one new engine design that can, is, we can all use is the best way to soup up all our runs at once. And guarantee our victory and do, as a dueling as auto as a dueling also um, dueling immortality will be out. What as do you as do you guys have to prove? You've already saved the world. If you ask me, it's alright if you rest as rest your as your leisure for a bit. No way, a true duelist never rests. There's always training, as uh, he's always training and getting better. That's right, Crow. But winning the Grand Prix isn't the only tra uh, training on fall. We may have saved the world, but I, it was too close for comfort. We nearly lost everything we cared for. A few days after speaking with Trudge, Yusei was challenged to a turbo duel by a mysterious duelist. Come forth, Yusei Fudo. Come forth and duel me. Why should I duel you? You have no choice, as you say. Your duel run has been tinkered with. Should you stop while in duel mode, it will explode. Story deck. I know it's a lot of effort for them to do, but I would love, like I say, I would love for them to go through this game and give us like custom duel modes for certain duels. 
a certain error type thing. Like, take away the links, everything, fire links. Like, let us do in them rules. But not only that, it'd be nice for like a duel like this, where in the anime, it's a full on turbo duel. Let us have a special turbo duel. Dueling! Just in duelings. I will grab. Junk, think run. And I will activate the other one. And grab, quick draw. Oh, I shall use quick draw's effect to ditch as him. Back to junk. Speed. You had him. He will go into a junk archer. Get one card face down. And my turn. I don't know how this is going to work actually, because. Special one from the extra deck, so therefore he has to technically go in the extra deck slot. Hmm. Wait, you have your own quick draw? I went um junk archer now. You can't attack him before he comes back and up. This monster kind of was a damper on my this plan this turn. What a chick. The wing. Oh, you would have been handy while I had a synchro on the field. Oh, there's his third monster. Oh. Did all that so you could attack me for 700. Oh, good lord, it's my savior. Come back, junk. By the effect of junk warrior, I shall bring back. Speed warrior. Then I shall also activate the effect of Quobalt Hedgehog in the graveyard. I have a tuner, I can special summon it from the graveyard. However, when it leaves the field, it has to be removed from play. 
Now this in turn, I will now Synchro Summon using Junk Synchron and Cobalt to Synchro Summon Junk Warrior! Now Junk Warrior against the attack strength of all level 2 and lower monsters killed. They're all in my side field. Gained 900 attack boost and he gains that permanently. Now I could activate Synchro Blast Wave but or in the game. Battle phase. I'm going to attack over it. Then go main phase two. Um, I've changed the event. So you can't change that to the event. What tie to that? This card attacks, it loses 300 attack during the damage step. Only if this card in your card, even battle card effects. Oh, card card effect. Fair enough. And one card. No one I don't want to really fuck with right now. We're gonna save the signal this way. <laughs> now it's time to get a mass amount of damage. I have to I do have to. Twenty five hundred damage right there. Don't mess with the power of Junk Warrior. Dark Hall Sorry, I couldn't start us road that because. Got two cards, that's right, exactly, that was my problem. That's for ya! Final phase. Back. Who are you? As my name is Shelley LeBlanc. As and I wanted to test how you handle pressure. Pass with flying colours. I want you on my team. You and I will ride together in the World Grand Prix. They all. Yeah? I simply must have you on my team. Why? You must know as as Monsieur Feudal. As I am as driven by my hunger for, for revenge, and I will stop at nothing until I finally achieve it. Against who? Against the order known as Iliasta. Remember that name? As they kidnapped my parents when I was a little girl. I managed to escape their grasp and spent my entire life on the run. Iliasta, I've heard that name from as Goodwin's brother, Roman. From, uh, from the little I have gathered, they are a secret society with wild ideas about the universe. They operate from the shadows. And anything to get rid of those who stand in their way. Which is why they came for my family. I'm so, so, so sorry. Iliasta is pulling the strings behind the upcoming World Racing Grand Prix. As this is why I want more than anything to win to get closer to them. I must know why Iliasta, what Iliasta did with my parents, what they are planning to do. I must win this race. 
and I know I can do it with you on my team. There's a long road ahead, as Mozami. As up until as until next time, you say Fudo. Boom, 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 boom. Challenge deck unlocked. The only time we have a doula. <laughs> The edge of elimination. So this is where the world tournament starts, and there's a lot that's happened between now and then. So like we just skip big plot points. Trudge as had offered a, as it had a bit of an issue that needed Yusei's help with. A stranger with amnesia was found on the shore of the Unicorn Boys. Yeah, was found on the shores of New Dawn City. This is going to be a bit of long reading. I hope you're all buckled in. As in Trudge needs someone to look after him. Unfortunately, the man, as uh, unfortunately, the now na man named Bruno didn't show up to meet you saying his friends. He was instead secretly tinkering with Jack's dual runner. There we go, all better. What in the deuce do you think you're doing with my dual runner? I eat little bugs like you for breakfast. Ah! Don't ever look at my dual runner again, fellas. What happened? We just got here and found this yoohoo messing with Jack's dual runner and trying to steal it. I know I wasn't. It was I saw an incredible dual runner and just had to start poking around. I couldn't help myself. Boys, this is Bruno. This is the stray you want us to adopt? Don't worry, we'll take it from here. Later on in Yusei's garage. Spit it, fella. Uh, spit it fast, you little fuck. What did you do to my door runner? Why do you think he did something? My uh, door runner's boost, uh, boosting uh, power is uh, charging faster. It is? I frontlined the DTR. The DTR. And adjusted the way your CP as uh, clinch as uh, Lingerman. So that's all. Uh, so that's all. Engine talk. Yu-Gi-Oh style. Okay, um, I have no idea what you said, but it sounds like you managed to give Jack's uh, runner a little bit more oomph, is that right? You gotta show me how, what you did. Your name's Bruno, is that right? I think that's my name? I don't know if Trudge told you. I'm having a hard time remembering thing, uh, things about myself. What's the last thing you remember about yourself? Waking up on the beach a few days ago? I have no sense of who I am, you say, but for whatever reason, working on dual runners just feels right. I hear you. Listen, Bruno, if you want, you can crash here with us, so you figure things out. Yeah, you don't mind? I've got to make this new engine model for the Grand Prix, and I think as a best as speed, with your help. What, so what do you say? Thinking of me as one more piece of the machinery, joining up to make uh, sure everything is working right. The start of the Grand Prix finally arrived. All the teams were gearing up, and the first match was USA's Team 5Ds against Team Unicorn. The Team Unicorn took a quick lead with, with their first duelist as Ariandre, as or, on, Andre, beating both Jack and Akiza. Team 5Ds was teething at the end of, end of elimination. It was up to Yusei to beat all three members of Team Unicorn. There's an impossible feat. Stardust, great. <laughs> Reinforcements of the army. <laughs> Turn one Stardust. I don't really want to give up my scrap iron. We will grab Fortress Warrior. And set him in defense mode. Down and meet him. Well, boys, he's turn one in synchroing. God, you are setting up a lot, aren't you? Mm. 
I send Fortress Warrior to the graveyard. Special summon Turret Warrior. I then normal summon Junk Synchron. Using his effect, I shall bring back Fortress Warrior. But now I shall synchro together Junk uh, Synchron and Turret Warrior together to make Stardust Dragon! Stardust Act the wrong Oh Well Bollocks We need a backup plan I can ram Max That's not exactly what I want you to do You get Now if I ram with Max Warrior, I'm going to leave myself utterly defenseless. Normal summon Max Warrior! Battle phase. Max Warrior will attack this monster has got zero attack. I've got Scrap Iron to defend it. Don't have any monsters that are stronger than Max Warrior within your Synchro, please! Okay, now you can just summon anything. Grab iron. Dash Warrior Battle Phase. Ash Warrior attack one of these. Well, it's a good thing I've only got one kind of man. Ram in. Into. Second one. Scrap iron. Battle phase attack this defensive monster. Why did I press B? I'm such a fool. Ah, uh, bollocks. What I do with sorting as uh, child and food as he and out. No problem. Scrap iron. Force truth. Bring out the fighter. Now, if I still have my dash war, I can bring out Stardust again.
Just getting more and more defenses. <laughs> 